What's up guys? Welcome back. Today we're going for a test drive at a 1968 Camaro. This one has a believed to be 350 under the hood. We're gonna be taking it down the road, checking out all the flaws. This one's got power steering, drum brakes all the way around. Try to have fun on this test drive, point out all the flaws at the same time. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. I post videos like this every single day. You can see individual walk around videos. There's always a two part to every car. Uh, just type in the year, the model and Maple Motors in the YouTube search bar. So example, 68 Camaro, Maple Motors. It'll pull up two videos of this car. And of course, if you go to my website, which is maplemotors.com, there's like a hundred detailed pictures, financing and shipping options on there. And all of our inventory, we update that every Monday. But for now, it's about that time. Let's go for a ride. I jumped off in the car here. Gonna look around the interior, kinda check everything out. Looks like a, an old hearse shifter. Or a B&M shifter down here. It's definitely a hearse. Checking the interior out. I got my bag and stuff in here to make this video. Headliner's not too bad. Package tray look pretty good. Interior still in good shape. The dash not all cracked up. Got a good look to it. Uh, I can tell you the miles, but I can't stand behind them on a 68 model car. That's what's on the dash there. I'm gonna try not to hit the gas, just start it up. Starts up nice and easy. Your oil pressure's coming up down here. Looks like it's around 30, 40. Water temperature's still low. Battery gauge is not hooked up. Uh, radio works. Blower motor. I got anything here? You'll need some uh, work on the blower motor. Windshield wipers, they look like they got decent blades on them. Working good. And place your bets. You think this horn works? Old Grant GT steering wheel. Let's try it out. Works pretty good. A little game we like to play here on the channel. All right, let's hit the road and see how she drives. Try to get my seat belts out. Multiple seat belts in this one. Anything that I see on this test drive, I will let you know. Kind of like our mirror. You gotta get a flathead screwdriver, tighten it up. It'll be all right. Uh, I said it had power steering, but this one doesn't feel like it's working. It's actually whining a little bit. I'm gonna check the fluid in it and make sure that uh, it's just not empty. We'll do that before we take off. And if it's empty, it's leaking. So I want y'all to know about that. Let's check it out. So I checked it, it is full. Uh, it's gonna have some power steering issues that have to be addressed. All right, let's take off. It's kind of widening and stuff, and it's real stiff. The car does feel nice and smooth going down the road. We're going pretty straight. The steering's actually nice and tight. As soon as I turn, it turns. Make sure I see who's behind me. I don't want to just floor it behind him or in front of a car. Kick down, hooked up. The car sounds pretty good. Speedometer's working, looks pretty accurate. Brakes, they're stopping fast for drum. This car's pretty tight. Uh, looks like our gas gauge is working. 
Checking over the other gauges, the temp gauge is still buried. It should be warm by now. I don't know if it's hooked up or not. We'll keep watching throughout the test drive. Signals are popping up on the dash here. And that is for both sides. Let's see if they click off automatically. They do. Good deal. So good, the car's nice and tight. I'm gonna jump off in this parking lot over here. We're gonna get some outside pictures. Um, I got some new gear I want to play with. I haven't put that below in the description, but I do have majority of everything I use below in the description with Amazon links, so you can do the same. All right, let's get these outside shots. Alright guys, got y'all set up in the driver's seat here. We're gonna head on out. Take this thing back to the lot and grab us another car. Everything's good so far. It actually looks like our temperature gauge decided to start coming up and it's not reading correct it says 150 do not believe that uh, temperatures i mean uh, uh oil pressure still at 30. but she still drives great show off suspension by driving around town. Well, I'm going to let this guy get way ahead of me. He's going real slow through here. Alright, speed bump's coming up right here. I like a little bit of rattling coming from the door here. But 
the suspension was nice and smooth. Everything's still reading good. Let's go ahead and pull back into the lot here. I'm going to grab another car. Definitely check out both videos, the test drive and the walk around. Um, that way you know everything about this car before you make your trip down. I appreciate y'all riding. If you have any other questions, definitely check out maplemotors.com for financing and shipping information. Close to 100 detailed pictures and every car on the lot is a, that is available will be on there. So definitely check that out. And if you have any other questions after that, give us a call, 615-822-4444. I do appreciate you watching. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. I try to post videos every day. I've got a few other cars to get to today before I uh, go home. So definitely keep watching. Thanks again.